This is the best exercise to really dial in your wedges from that awkward distance of 40, 60 yards. It's amazing, regardless of our levels of, of golf, whatever your handicap is, we have a hard time hitting shots right next to the hole. If you have a 50 yard shot, it's weird that it's difficult to hit it exactly 50. Ironically, if I said this, it's 50 yards to the, to the target, but hit it short of the green, we could do that almost every time. If I say hit it over the green, you could do that every time. And, and it's really more of a mindset. So this drill, what you're gonna do is you're gonna pick a 50 yard shot. I picked a 55 yard shot here. And you're actually gonna practice hitting it short of the green and over the green. You're not even gonna hit it at the pin, but it's very specific. And one of the reasons why this is so good for us and it works is when we try to hit a 50 yard shot and we're trying to hit the ball close, we're not specific enough in our mind of exactly where we're trying to hit it. So we got a 50 yard shot here and I'm, I've, got my, I've got my sand wedge and I'm just gonna land it about, about 10 yards short of that green. I'm gonna look at the target, go back. Yep, just short of the green. And you really have to look at it and tell yourself, did I land the ball about where I wanted to? And usually you're gonna be so much more accurate when you look at a target where it's, you have a pin but you're hitting to a different location. And that's only because we're so specific about where we're actually trying to hit it. I'm gonna hit one more. This time I'm gonna hit it a little bit more left and a little bit longer, but still short of that green. Go back, a little bit longer. See it's gonna bounce down the hill. Oh, pretty good. Next two golf balls, I'm gonna hit this over the green. The ball must land over the green. I don't care if it's 10 yards over, 20 yards over, 30 yards over, and this is just really building awareness. All right. And again, you could see I tried to hit it over the green and it landed just on the edge. I was about two feet short of the back edge of the green. And all I'm doing is I'm building awareness and saying, okay, I guess when I try to hit the ball longer, I tend to, I tend to land the ball short. All right. I'm gonna go past over the green again. Oh, now it's very clear of my own mistake. When I try to hit it longer, I don't hit it hard enough. That's the number one thing that we're trying to learn in this exercise is what are the issues? There is no swing in the world that can fix the mindset of being afraid to hit it too hard. And it could be as simple as that. All right, let's see what it takes to hit it over the green. It's amazing our mind doesn't want to hit it any harder. This exercise really shows the distance doesn't matter. I'm telling you right now that the distance of the shot, does, whether it's 40 yards or 50 yards or 60 yards, it's not proportional. Like I will go to 80 yards and if you're doing this exercise, I will miss it exactly the same way at 40. And it's kind of learning yourself and learning the concept. All right, we've got about 50 yards. And this time, there we go. That landed about five yards past the green. 
the amazing thing is I felt like I had to hit that 80. It felt like I'm hitting an 80 yard shot just to hit it maybe 65 yards, 60, 65 yards. So this is just a good example to build awareness when it comes to distance control with your wedges.